Happy Wednesday, friends. All right, staring contest in three, two, one, go. Oh, I blinked. Well, kids, today we get to talk about our next beatitude. Last week, we started off with Matthew chapter 5, verse 1 through 4. Let's read it again. Now, when he saw the crowds, he went up a mountainside and sat down. His disciples came to him, and he began to teach them, saying, Blessed are the poor in spirit, for theirs is the kingdom of heaven. Blessed are those who mourn, for they will be comforted. Today, we get to look at verses 5 through 6, and it reads, Blessed are the meek, for they will inherit the earth. Blessed are those who hunger and thirst for righteousness, for they will be filled. Now, kids, what does meek mean? Sometimes people think that being meek means being weak. Get it? Meek and weak rhymes. But, uh, but really what it means is when a person humbles themselves to know that God takes full control over their life. They go along with what God wants for them and do not think that they have a better plan. Now, for people who are meek, they have humility. They don't go around parading themselves as the best or know-it-alls or think that they have full power and control over everything. Now, with this attitude, they will inherit the earth and everything God brings for them. Now, what about righteousness? How can we hunger and thirst for something we cannot eat? Well, the Bible says, kids, that Jesus is the bread of life and the living water. When we fill ourselves with Jesus and his love and his teachings, our spirits are fed. And we grow every day to be more and more like him. We get stronger in Christ. Just like when we eat food, we eat food to nourish our bodies, to keep them strong and healthy. Just like our spirits. Our spirits need food too, and that food is the word of God. Our spirit gets stronger and healthier, and it grows. Those who hunger and thirst for more of God, when you have the attitude of wanting to grow your spirit, God says that he will fill you and you will be satisfied. Aren't these Beatitudes just amazing to learn? Well, kids, we have a lot more to cover. So tune in to next Wednesday for more of our Beatitudes. See you guys on Sunday. I hope you guys have a great week. Make sure you do all your homework and you pay attention in your Zoom classes. I love you, kids. Bye.